Good morning, friends and fellow farmers. All right. The weather for tomorrow is... Uh, it's going to be super warm. Ooh. Nice and, and pleasant. I'm not going to worry about education. Let's go to entertainment. Star Lily Heart Snatcher, episode 14. Summary. Unbelievable. Star Lily Heart Snatcher struck again. Miss Ayami. What? My goodness. But it isn't even 7 p.m. yet. Lovely Detective Sakura. But there is this, though. Miss Ayami. Another letter? I see. I'm sure it is just the typical receipt, but let us confirm. It says, Receipt. One piece of leftover lunch bread. Received by Star Lily Heart Snatcher. I thought so. Lovely Detective Sakura. Still, I wonder what happened this time. It isn't even 7 p.m. yet. Miss Ayami. Hmm, I'm afraid I don't know. Lovely Detective Sakura. Sigh. It looks like Star Lily Heart Snatcher really hoodwinked us this time. To be continued. Okay, the oh, tomorrow is Valentine's Day. For those who can participate, don't forget to prepare some chocolates for that special special gentleman. Or, or lady, I guess. Oh, interesting. I should be uh, going and doing chocolate thing. I'm going to leave the fruit today. I'm gonna head straight over. I should be riding my horse. Okay. Let's just get straight in there. And we'll see how we can do. All right. There we go. Okay. There we go. <laughs> so. Uh, I will try to stay away from the edge of the ladder and the outer edge. And we'll see what we can do here. Okay. There we go. Oh, no, no, no. This way, my friend. Come on. Go down. Okay, uh, I guess I can try there. Uh, and we'll go around this way. Oh, there we are. Oh, good. Okay, so we're on level six. Good, we're starting to get some of our anti-fatigue. Okay, level seven. Down we go. Level 8. Okay, so I think what I'll do is I'll start uh, munching on my my anti-fatigue grass here. Now, how do I tell... Uh, let's see here. Um, where does it show my... Does it show me my fatigue more specifically anywhere other than that, the, the me making yucky faces? I really don't know. I don't think it does, does it? I mean, I've got my sing songometer. I know that that's good. Okay, let's, let's stow that. Okay, you can be anywhere around here if you want to. Ladder, that will be cool. There we go. Level nine. All right, so yeah, I also, uh, yeah, I'm not gonna worry about that, the fishing deal there. Let's go down. Oh boy. Getting tuckered. Alright, let's eat some food. I think it's time to crack out the uh, the udon. And we'll put that away and we'll keep mining. Okay. It seems really exciting when you end up hitting... Uh, money but i feel like it's it's not that much <laughs> it's it's not as exciting as you would hope oh uh no i want to come this way i feel like this one might actually be behind a rock 
Oh, hello. Uh, now, I I feel like I want the sinkholes, but at the same time, do I want the sinkholes? Uh, like, they're good to go down, but is it in fact a good thing? <laughs> I, I question, I don't know. Let's find ourselves, I mean, if that's, maybe that's the only way down. Is, that's the other thing, is on the ladder, the levels where there uh, is a sinkhole, is there also a ladder? Pardon me, I'm just going to experiment a bit here because I, I don't really know. And I don't think there'll be anything. Yeah, interesting. Okay, I guess I'll just take the sinkhole? I don't know, I don't know that there's any any advantage to not taking it. I feel like it's it's a good thing. Okay, so there is a ladder. Interesting. Hmm. Okay, let's have a little bit more of our grass and we'll have some udon. Oh, oh I'm all full of that stuff. Wow, okay. Uh, you know what? I will just have a piece then. I don't know what, uh, okay, let's just pop down. Well, how far did we fall? 14. All right. Okay, uh, there we go. Bag of money. Okay, so I think we need to smash some stuff here, right? Let's, uh, let's get the hammer out. Okay, and we'll try and smash right around this, I think. Okay. Now, uh, let's go over here and we will go up and eat some more of our udon. And I think I'll go full and then grab... Okay, it's because these ones were... I'm going to be grabbing anything. Sells for a good amount. You're right. Okay, so I do want those ones if I'm going to bother getting something. Okay, so now we'll, let's go and uh, finish our looking for an exit here. Huh. Oh, there it is. Okay, so it wasn't hiding that far. Level 15. Okay, there we go. Level 16. Down we go. Okay. Uh, I guess we'll just break on through here. Alright, let's see now. How far away are we going to have to go? Oh, there it is. All right. No, can't get over there. So we'll have to bust some rocks. All right, that's fine. Let's bust some rocks. Okay. And I'll try here. Oh, no. Here this way, buddy. Alright, let's keep on going here. So, so far we're not, uh, we're not getting rich, but that's okay. I think we're doing alright on the, uh, oh, on the number of levels. Okay, and let's keep going this way. There we go, there's our exit. So, let's, uh, you know what, let's have some udon. Uh, doop, boop, boop. Okay, and then we'll, uh, then we'll go down. All right. Level 19. What? We found a power berry. Nice. Oh my gosh, awesome. Okay, I didn't know we could find such things. That's fantastic. 
So that was from hoeing. Interesting. So I guess, at, I don't know if it's on um, certain layers or if that's just in randomized luck. What, what that is. Cool. All right. Well, that's very nice. Powerberry is exciting. Oh, a hole right there. I didn't even notice. Okay, let's see what's continuing on over this way. It's a lot of potential on these big ones. It's like you feel like the exit could be pretty much anywhere. So we're on level 25. So, so far, so good. Come on, bud. Am I really that tired? All right. And uh, let's continue on here. I guess we are hoeing up a storm, so fair enough. Okay, and then we'll come back this way, I guess. Oh, there it is. There's the exit. Okay, 26. Okay, so what I'm going to do is... Uh, let's get rid of that. Sure, and then we'll take that. All right. What I'm going to do is... Uh, we'll just eat that black grass right now. Okay, and then we'll continue hoeing here. Oh, there we are. Perfect. Level 28. Oh, hole in the ground. <laughs> 31. All right. This is good. So this is a... Uh... Okay, so again, I'm curious if I, if, like, if I want... Oh, whoa. See that? I wouldn't have even... I didn't realize there would be multiples. Interesting. Okay, so this is like, are they actually a thing I want? <laughs> I mean, I think I do. Whoa, there's three. Okay, that is bananas. There's a ladder down. I'm just, I'm kind of fascinated by this, of because uh, last time I don't recall seeing more than one ever. So it's just intriguing to me that there is... I also ran around like a lunatic trying to trigger them, so that, I think that was the other... It was improbable I would ever see more than one. <laughs> okay. Well, I think I'm just going to jump down one soon, but anyway, I'm, I'm very curious. And then, oh, and then let's eat some mood on. All right, and then uh, we'll get rid of a little fatigue there as well. Okay, let's put that away. All right, well, let's just fall down a hole. <laughs> I guess that's what that is. Level 36, all right. Oh, go down, sure. 37. Go down, 38. Okay, so I think I'm going to have to smash some stuff to get on out of here. Let's try this, and, uh, oh, hello, what was that? Uh, I don't even know what that was. I thought something f flew up at me there. Is it just because I have no room? Maybe. Okay, so let's... I'm wondering if I'm not uh, really activating too much in the way of um, uh, fatigue yet because I'm not doing a ton of mining. kind of wonder. I, I think we're almost at a... 
Oh, I, I'm not certain. Like now, no, uh, that I know it's like ridiculously deep. How deep should I go before I really crank into the mining? I'm guessing the lower the better. Okay, well, we'll go down. Level 42. Okay, and then we'll smash a few rocks here. Okay, uh, we're all tired. Okay. And we'll continue on. Now, is the amethyst actually oop, uh, worth a fair amount? It sells for a decent amount, a good amount. And then these red things, I don't really remember. You know, I'm not going to worry, I guess, too much about it. Not at this point. It's not like it's diamonds or anything. Oh, and we fell down a hole. So I guess there's reasons why somebody would not want to fall down a hole if they were wanting to mine out that whole area and then... I could see that being an inconvenience. You going, oh, I, like, I did not want to fall down a hole. That was not the, opt the optimal solution I was looking for. Like, it kind of makes you wonder, okay, is there, like, does this level have good stuff in the rocks? Well, what are, like, I, what are these red ones again? So, hmm. Uh, well, let's eat a f eat some food. How about that? So I'll go over here and eat the food. Okay, so we got the... Those things, which are... Decent amount. Okay. And then we'll put that away and we'll just keep smashing here. It actually seems like there's a decent amount of ores here. Unlike some of the others, they give you a lot of other garbage. This this one's not really giving guff, is it? So it does make me feel like maybe this is a good level. And uh, eating a bunch, making some extra room, maybe not the worst thing we could be doing. Okay, and then... Uh, I feel like I've, I'm not in, inducing enough... Uh, fatigue yet. Okay, now this is what I wanted to see. What is this one? Decent amount, decent amount, good amount. Okay, I'm not going to worry about it. Let's go down the hole. Okay, level 51. Down we go. Okay, and then I think we will... Smash a couple of spots here. And uh, let's see what we can do. So at level 52, I don't know if I'm going to bank on making it quite as low as that again. We'll see though. It just depends how fast it goes. We're at about 20 minutes, so it's not bad actually. So I could see if we can continue our pace here. I could see... Uh, Make, yeah, 54, and we're we're doing all right. Okay, let's continue this way. Okay. Huh. All right. So with it not being. So again, I get, is that just the indicator I'm hungry, or is that the indicator I'm getting fatigued? <laughs> I mean, I think thought the face was for fatigue, so I'm probably just getting hungry? I don't know. And let's uh, get the hammer out. Oh. Yeah, 
Yeah, see, this, the scrap ore to ore ratio definitely seems like it improves dramatically as we've gotten lower here. I do wish I could remember, like, what was sold for good amounts. I didn't even think to, like, kind of remember that before I started here, but at least we got the, the blue one. We know that's going to be a good amount. Yeah, this is kind of an obscene uh, hole here, isn't it? I think I'm kind of waiting to also get to a, like a diamond level. Okay, so let's let's hoe our way out. Oh, there we go. Now uh, I'm gonna eat some udon. Okay, so I guess I'll take the green stones. <laughs> And we'll go over here and consume some more of these. Now, I should probably also... Okay, I'm going to do that. And then uh, I, I guess I loaded up on the green stones. So, I mean, like, really... And there was a couple, like, one blue stone here. So I don't know that that's really... Oh, there's one. Okay. Because those are the ones that... Yeah, there's two. These are the ones I want to fill up on really, is the blue ones here, because I wanted to see those sell for a good amount. We want to sell those. I don't remember what those things are. Is that? Oh, there's a few more. Okay, let's just, we'll just clear this level. Level 54. No, not too much else. Okay, and then we'll come and uh, let's Oh, so I was, <laughs> I'm busy looking at my inventory and not paying attention. That was fantastic. I'm like, I probably over ate by three meals. Uh, I guess, again, I'm torn, right? Like these big levels, I'm like, do I want to find out if there's anything else? I don't recall those being that lucrative. We're at seven on those. We're at seven on amethyst as well. Not that those sell for a tremendous amount. Okay, well, we found a hole, so that's fine. 57. All right, so let's go now and... Uh, Let's eat one of our anti-fatigue grasses. Maybe we'll eat a couple of those. And we'll eat some food, and then we'll keep on going here. All right. Okay, and how about here? Oh, there's our way down. Perfect. I'll take the cash, thank you. Oh, hole in the ground. All right. What, uh, what are we at now? 60. Okay. That's a, yeah, we're doing a much quicker <laughs> run down this deep. This is good. And once again, we get, once we get to... Um, I think we'll have no problem getting to 100, so that's good. Okay, let's, let's eat this. And go down. All right. Um, again, I'm kind of like, I'm suspicious now of these. <laughs> I, I want to check now more around this level. Okay, let's eat that. And that. Okay, now what is this that I've got? Sells for a decent amount. Okay, well that's fine. So we'll take a few more of those if we can. Got an amethyst. Oh, and we fell down. <laughs> okay, 62. Okay, let's uh, 
Let's hoe forth here. Hoe forth and find a place to crawl down. Okay, now I will grab another uh, anti-fatigue thing here. Pick that one up. And down we go. 63. Oh, I ate one instead of putting it away. Let me just spend some in my inventory. Hole in the ground. Okay, interesting. Okay, place to go down. So I, I still am running with the assumption that these are like positive in the sense like Stardew Valley where you um, you find the hole in the ground and you are uh, wanting to get those because it's a quick route down. They do seem kind of random, although they do seem like they get you get more of them as you go here. But I'm curious, like, is there any downfall other than I'm assuming like kind of like fatigue or whatever? see any other there's a lot of them though like that's incredible okay I'm just gonna go down okay so now I need to come over here and let's munch on some grass and uh, also have some food Okay, and we'll come back up here and we will eat some black grass. Actually, we should eat some white grass because, there we go, we, uh, that way we can clear that out. We have more inventory. Oh, <laughs> it's going to take the ladder anyway. We're level 71. Okay, this is good. Excellent. 72. I'm, I'm pleased that this run is so much faster. I was thinking, I was like, how does anybody manage to do this if it was this slow all the time? I was thinking that's that's really arduous, like to to go repeatedly through here. So now um, this is making a lot more sense to me, just in terms of overall strategy and yeah, why how, how you would approach this. All right, so I think we'll break some rock over here. There we are. There's a lot of money on this layer, which kind of makes me like, okay, so am I gonna find anything good if I break rocks here? Or is money like the, what is it's making up for the fact that there's not much? I don't know. Yeah, the hammering really takes out of you. Wow. You almost feel like with the better hammer, you would use less. Okay. Um, and these sell for a decent amount. Okay, everything's a decent amount. That's fine. Now let's find our way out. Okay, there we go. Okay, we're on level 75. 76. 77. Uh, let's go there. Love when you try and hoe on an angle and it just won't have for it. Game's like, I get what you're trying to do, but you know what would be cool is if that doesn't happen and instead, hear me out, we just hope oh, weirdness. Okay. There we are, of course. Oh. And there. Oh, 
Oh, there it is. Alright. Now I think I'm going to try and hammer a few things on this one. Okay, so there's more of those uh, moonstones or whatever. Okay, we'll eat, eat some of this up. Put that away. Okay. So yeah, this is the part where I go, all right, so if this is like, sells for a decent amount, I'm going to go and get rid of that. No, I want to get the blue one. Uh, oh. <laughs> okay, can we... Decent amount. Yeah, no. There we go, that's the one I'm looking for. And then uh, let's also keep at it with that. Oh, no, no, no. That was too many. Too many. Yeah, I wish you could almost like mouse over and see what something is. It's a little like, oh, I, I don't know what that is. Now, those are just those soapstones. Those don't look like the, they're not diamonds or anything. I forgot I already found the exit. I'm busy smashing and bashing over here. I'm really, I don't even, like, I guess just in terms of, um, you want to, you're going to end up with a variety because you're not going to end up with enough of the thing that you necessarily want. Okay. I think I'm going to stop there then. Uh, these are the cruddy things, right? <laughs> Uh, let's, you know what I'm going to do. Let's go over here. Boop, 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 boop. Okay, now we got that, and... Moonstone. Sells for a small amount. Right, okay, so I don't really want those. So, that's fine. Uh, let's get rid of two of those. And that is more, uh, whatever, that sells for a... These all sell for a good amount. Oh, right, okay, so the the dark red sells for a good amount. All right, let's get rid of this then and go... Yes, that's what we want. We want those. Okay, any more? <laughs> any more takers? No, that's it? All right. Oh, no, let's not use our axe. That's, that's advanced mining. All right, I'm feeling a little bit more together now. I think we're we're starting to get better resources. Okay, let's just get on down. It's level 78, 79. Okay, I should have eaten the fatigue grass actually. And I'm going to fall down a hole. What does it take me to? 86. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, I blew through a pile of food there. Didn't even notice that. Okay, and we'll come down here and start on that. All right. Anything good here? Yeah, I guess we, we're finding some, there's some good stones. Oh, and I'm going to fall down a hole. Right. So I, I do, yeah, I remember before then, I like oh, falling down the holes almost turned out to be just as useful as like just like mining like crazy, falling down holes instead of digging a ton. <laughs> I think that's how we ended up getting to level 100, just about 91. So we don't want to go too far. That's the thing. I want to hit 100. Uh, 
Okay. Let's go over here and uh, have ourselves some foods. Okay, now... Okay. Uh, I don't have any trash. Part of me is just tempted to get rid of uh, a decent amount, decent amount, decent amount. Oh, that is the aquamarine. That's aquamarine. Okay, never mind then. <laughs> I'm busy thinking, I'm like, should I be getting more of this aquamarine? Not really, no. Okay, and is that it? All right, so I'm gonna have to hold my way out of here, fine. I guess I should take the free money. Level 92. Okay, there's a way down. 93. Uh, okay, let's try and actually hit this thing. So I think at this point I do want to find the ladder and not go down the random holes. I don't remember how many on average, I can end up going down. I haven't paid enough attention. It's a few, though, isn't it? All uh, right, there we are. Hmm. Okay, I think I'll smash through here. We'll smash through a few of these. All right, anything here? Hmm. Okay, how about these? Well, we'll just we'll continue hoeing here then. Oh. Oh, do I need to eat a meal? Probably. Okay, let's have ourselves a meal. Um All right. Let's see here. Uh, it's probably not going to be a there. And why don't we try? Try out this way. Okay, then we'll try out this way. Wrong way, buddy. Okay, there we are. Level 95. And we'll keep going around. I'm going to stick pretty close, I think, initially here. Oh, there we are. 96. Okay, so we got a ladder. So I think what I'm going to do now is let's, let's smash some stuff and see what's down here. Now these ones, um... Okay. I guess we should, I should be careful about racing ahead too fast here. As I do want to uh, make sure I don't fall down a hole. I do want to take the ladder. Okay, so it doesn't seem like there's a, you know, a plethora of diamonds or anything here. Getting a little bit tired. All right, let's take that. And we'll go on down. All right, 97. 
Okay, let's uh, hammer through here. Okay, so now I'm gonna have to dump something else. We got two of these good uh, stones here. So what should I get rid of? Um, good amount, decent amount. Oh, decent amount. Okay, let's get rid of all of these. Perfect. Okay. Okay, and then we got the same deal here. We need to pick a different thing. Um, I'm going to get rid of all that. Oh. Perfect. Okay. So hopefully I go up with mostly a good haul of, of expensive stuff. And it does seem like we're getting to that point now where it's a proliferation of that. Okay, and then these pink ones. Um, there we go. And let's get rid of uh, that junk that's there. And then what are these worth? Probably a small amount, a decent amount. Well, it's, it's easy enough to get a large collection of them, isn't it? All right, 98. Oh, there it is, 98, and we're at 99. Okay, so we have a ladder there. I'm just going to test out what is here. Those things we don't really want. See, it's two decent. These are good ores. These will sell for a good amount, so I'm happy about those. Okay, it's one. This level's got tons of these things. Okay, I think I'm just going to go down. Okay, we're at level 100. So, this time... Let's, uh... See if we can't find something good here. Okay. Now I'm hoping, fingers crossed, we can find some good stuff. Because this is what we were, I was wanting to find is another, like, $10,000 uh, dealio here. That would be nice. Okay. And that, we didn't find a, there wasn't, like, a, a pitfall in that one. Or whatever you call it, like a hole in the ground. A trap. I don't know what a cave in. <laughs> Something we don't want to run into when you're mining. Something bad. So we'll see. Uh, somebody had noted that they only found, uh, they tend to find like one on this level. So I don't know, we just had good luck. Um, so I don't know, we'll see. Maybe maybe that's a one-time deal. Maybe we'll have uh, gotten all of the good stuff. Oh, I missed one back there. All right. This level takes it out of you, though. Wow. Just the sheer volume of uh, stones to break. <laughs> it's like this is where you need all your your energy for, and it's it's so worth it for the, the amount of uh, income you can walk away with. All right, so that's not bad. Forty-five, may have forty-five minutes, and we've made it uh, already down to here. So that's a lot better. That's a much quicker run. 
So it's good to know we can do it in about 45 minutes. And again, probably even slightly faster. Wow, okay. So nothing so far. This is a huge level, though. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh. Oh, there we are. Now, I, haven't even, I haven't even had time to ramble, so I'll ramble a little bit. If, uh, if anybody's looking for a good read, uh, I'm currently reading a book on uh, the biography of Jean Arthur, um, the actress, uh, by John Aller, and it's really good. I, it has a terrible co like the cover is kind of cheesy. It's it just looks like a publisher that's you know pretty niche and they're not spending a ton of money on marketing and they know hey the people that are gonna buy this thing they're gonna buy this thing so let's just slap Jean Arthur's photo on the front and we'll use a font and then put words. It's it's you know it's a well enough made bug, but it's not uh, it's it's kind of a no frills, uh, but it's it's really well done. <laughs> the, the writing is actually really quite good. Uh, really compelling. Those kinds of biographies, I don't know, I, to me they're kind of hit and miss. But it's, uh, I very much enjoyed it. So if you've enjoyed Gene Arthur's films, uh, you you would very much like it. It's really good. Um, and if you don't know Gene Arthur's films, well, you should go watch Gene Arthur's films because they're fantastic. She was, um, I don't know, I guess associated heavily with the screwball comedies of like the 30s and 40s. Um, she's a really, really good actress, um, but didn't fit in with Hollywood at all. She got, uh, her and the head of Paramount were at a, at odds to put it mildly. And, uh, she hated doing interviews. Uh, she was very anti, she wasn't into being a celebrity and that cost her, uh, somewhat, I think at a time period where that was like the birth of the celebrity era in a big way and the tabloids and everything, and she just wasn't into it, and uh, really didn't feel at ease with acting at all, even. Yet she loved doing it, it seemed like, but also made her very, like, ill. <laughs> so, it really, uh, yeah, it's a really nice book. It's just an interesting snapshot of that time period in Hollywood, and, you know, a look at, uh, it's, it's not even so comprehensive about her co-stars, because she doesn't really, it's not from her perspective, so it's not dishing dirt. You know, she worked with Cary Grant and um, Joel McRae, uh, lots of the great actors at the time. So she's, um, it, yeah, it's not uh, because she didn't give many interviews or tell many people things. You know, some of her confidants in, in life uh, provides some insight into her character, but it's a lot of like sleuthing by the, the writer, which is partly why, oh, there we go. Yes, we got one. Um, but partly why it's such a good book is that the author put so much effort into sleuthing about her life. So it's, uh, yeah, it's anyway, it's it, again, if you don't even know who she is very well, or if you've seen like one of her movies, it's still super fascinating about that time period. So that's, uh, I would highly recommend that. I'm not, I ought to be fair. I'm not quite finished it, but I'm, I'm a good chunk of the way through and, uh, I'm up, I'm through her Hollywood career phase, and then her we have her acting phase in the end, where she does a more stage stuff, and I think teaches acting or something. So, yeah, through the uh, the the real traumatic parts of it. All right, and that I think that's it. Let's just do a double check here. So we got one one stone, but that's fine. That's what like ten thousand. That's going to pay for another maker machine <laughs> or go towards that's a down payment on one. We've got 20 grand in the bank currently, so that's good. Uh, let's go now and let's go see uh, what we can do um, for some more levels here. Okay, we're not going to hit level 255. I don't see that. I'm not going for like a super completionist run. I actually feel like if you were doing that, you wouldn't even, uh, you, you wouldn't necessarily uh bother with like the stones what what is that a kappa statue a statue of kappa it doesn't look like kappa from the lake what what is so what do i do with this 
I'm presuming it just goes in my house. Okay, that's really cool. <laughs> wow. I can't, okay, let's put it away. I, well, well, actually, I need food. Huh, that's really neat. Okay, so there's yet more secrets. I'm sure there's tons more secrets that I'm not aware of, so I just hold that up. Um, so that suggests me hoeing is going to maybe lead to more interesting things. Okay, found our way down. Oh, no, I wanted to just... It's going to hold a bit more. Again, I don't know, like, if you when you find things in... Is there clusters of things? Is there onesies? I, I feel like, again, this run I've discovered more things, so it's... Um, yeah, it's interesting. It makes me wonder about, uh, like, what else is kind of hiding down in these different spaces. All right, let's go down. That's fine. Huh. Okay, so let's uh, smash some rocks. You know, we haven't even seen, like, diamonds and stuff yet, because I, whatever layer that was on, I blew by that. So we'll have to figure out again what where the good stuff is, and we'll go after some of that. I think we've got enough food to last a while, so I think we'll be able to do that. Because I may as well like these, you know, the stones that are worth a good amount. I don't remember what the price difference is between them, but hey, if we can do that, that we may as well. Okay, clearly we're getting like one type of thing here, so let's just get out of here. Okay, I should eat some food. That's my cue. Oh, and you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take. Uh, you know, I will just see what these are worth. It's a decent amount, right? Okay, so we'll just take a stack, and then if I need to ditch them, we'll do that. Oh, I, I had so many. I was like, why aren't any more coming? It's because we had them all. <laughs> all right. And in terms of thinking of now what else I've been watching lately, uh... Watched a bunch more Cary Grant movies, and some of them better than others. Um, watched uh, The Grass is Greener. That was a weird movie. Um, if you can picture Robert Mitchum from, uh, like, Night of the Hunter, who, I mean, he's brilliant in that. Or in, like, you know, some of his Cal uh, westerns and stuff. He's, he's a phenomenal actor. Picture him as a romantic lead. An American in uh, England who is gonna steal away Cary Grant's wife uh, and already if your disbelief ometer hasn't gone off um, it's it's kind of like Cary Grant is like the husband who's put upon and goes you know whatever you uh, figure it out and isn't gonna worry about it but then tries to win his wife back in the end and uh, or her, her affections back I should say as she is not property and uh, yeah, it's Cary Grant's good. You know, he would have been better in the suave role, but you can see why they wouldn't have put him in that. He would, because then, uh, who who would have like like stuck around if Cary Grant was like, yeah, yeah, let's go? They would have been like, all right, I'm out of here. See a sucker. I feel like that was much more likely than uh, let's eat some of this. Um. So at any rate, yeah, that was uh. That was a weird movie. Decent amount. Okay. Um, I don't even know which... I mean, I guess I could start with here and just get rid of this. And then I... Just to confirm that this is... Oh, it's a good amount. Oh, okay. So that's, that's, that's a good amount as well. Beautiful. All right. Well, let's, let's go get some more of that. Um, what else did I watch? Uh, To Catch a Thief, another Cary Grant. That was also very good. And, yeah, no, we've watched yeah, a variety of different ones lately of his. And, you know, he's always good. It's not that the films are not always the greatest. 
sometimes you're like, yes, this is it. And then other times you're like, ah, it's okay. But, but he's always good. <laughs> but yes, Robert Mitchum as a, as a leading romantic interest. I don't know. I di maybe that's just me. I just, I didn't buy it. I went, eh, I don't know. I don't know that I buy that at all. Um, again, it's hard to see, you know, he's so brilliant in uh, Night of the Hunter that it's almost difficult to see him outside of that role. Like that, I, I could see how that role must have been hard for him as a defining role um, because it, he be, must have become so attached. It must have been really hard to get away from the typecasting of playing the kind of villainous character. I mean, one of the greater villains and to then, you know, try to do, to stretch out and do like a romantic movie or something like people don't want to see you in that role. So it'd be hard, especially if, you know, for somebody like who's serious about their acting. Uh, let's try, we'll, we'll have three of these. Uh, yeah, we'll eat the third one and that should get me, I don't want this. Okay. Oh, uh, this is the problem when you get to this point where you're like jettisoning stuff. Okay, there we go. And that's what we want. And you do get to this point where it's like you you start getting these stones rather fast too. So like if I get another green one, I've got to now ditch something else. But I want to find the green one, so I'm willing to keep searching. Yeah, look at that. Like three right there. Oh, uh, okay. Let's go and ditch uh, all of these. <laughs> like I didn't, I didn't want that. Okay. All right. So we'll take that. Oh, and there we are. Good. Okay. So we got two of those. Yeah, this is actually not a bad haul. So as long as I can walk out of here with pretty much everything being sells for a, a good amount, uh, at least we'll have a decent haul then. I might not have all the most uh, rare and luxurious things, but at like this point, I don't even need... I guess the diamonds and stuff would be nice. I would trade the diamonds out. Um, I feel like the diamonds, like, that's not a diamond, if I'm not mistaken. I hope it's not. <laughs> See, am I a good? I'm a good amount on all these things, aren't I? Decent. Okay, let's get rid of these. Okay, and then that is aquamarine. Decent. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's fine. No biggie. We'll get rid of those, I'm sure, soon enough. Wow. So uh, yeah, in this little mine here, I'm sure we could basically blow through, uh, have everything up to good amount. Okay, and I'll start with these ones. There we go. And then still also uh, trying to barrel through uh, Mae West movies, which are uh, you know, once now that I have her, we have a better feel for her shtick. Uh, it it becomes much less entertaining over time, and it, it it's still just amazing to me that she was able to build such a career off that character. Um, it's quite the thing. It's you know she's a she's a show person like she's got a she's got a whole. I, I admire what she accomplished. I don't necessarily her acting's like eh, but her. Uh, um, pulling that character off and, you know, going through with the confidence to do that is it, it, still pretty difficult, I'm sure. It must have been a very weird, um, a weird thing to go from not doing films to middle, middle age doing films, being super successful. I mean, as a metric, uh, Gene Arthur is quoted as being paid $120,000 uh, a year, when, like more than the president, I think, at that time period. So she was very well paid as an actress. Mae West at that same year, um, I think this was like 30, I want to say 39 or something. Um, sometime in the 30s, I believe, was making $500,000 a year. <laughs> so an, an utterly astounding amount of money for that time period, just as a point of comparison. 
Okay, so we've gotten rid of all those. Wow, this is ridiculous. Okay, uh, let's eat some food. Like, I wouldn't mind some more really good stuff. That's the thing that's getting me. Um, I think I will... I think I will stop on this level and just keep on trucking. So I'm sure we'll find another layer where I will find even like more diamonds or more valuables that I'm gonna I'm gonna be wanting to jettison more stuff at some point. I don't want to be on the edges, I don't think. Alright, let's see here. There we go. Okay, so we're on floor 106. Okay, and I'm gonna just gonna hit a few things we're gonna see where we're at. And I don't really remember like what uh, you know diamond layer was, what the preferred. Uh, see, this is all pretty good stuff. So if you get down to this level, you have yeah, definitely no excuse to to not jettison everything that isn't good. It's uh, definitely it seems like it pays off. But then, um, yeah, I can't, uh, we're not getting anything like super good, so let's go down. Level 107. Yeah, nothing good, but. Okay, and so now we're already at, see, there's like three more r rubies or whatever there. And what I, should, what I should do here, let's eat these two udon. <laughs> I like how like the, the u most useless stone that you don't want is going to be the one that uh, you, you definitely attract. <laughs> really? <laughs> Again. Okay. There we go. There's like three more good stones. It's ridiculous. All right. Wow. Yeah, we're just getting at it again a point where I can't even take it. So I might as well break the last thing. Maybe it's no nothing good. All right, let's find ourselves a ladder. And there it is. All right. 108. Okay, so there's our ladder. Let's smash a few rocks. Moonstones. Or whatever they were called. Yeah, okay, so this seems like it's big on this stuff, but that's about it for us. Alright, let's uh let's let's get ourselves some food. Okay, so yeah, it's just, it's a lot of those. All right, let's find another layer. And we'll find ourselves an exit here right away. There's the exit, beautiful. Now let's go see what this layer has to offer. Is it gonna be those things? Hmm. All right, uh, I'm gonna go over and actually Like I, that's great, thank you, uh, stones. But I, I don't want that one. No, also uh, I don't want that one. And also I don't want that one. Oh, I want both of those. There we go. All right, let's just go down. Floor one hundred and ten. Now there probably is some logic to like how to find the fantastic mega floor that has all mountains of diamond. Okay, see, there we go. There's a diamond. <laughs> Finally. Now, uh, what do I want to get rid of here to get this? 
Oh, no, I didn't want to do that. Okay, so let's go and... Oop. Um, good, 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 good amount. Do, 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 do. Very good. And... Okay, so I don't think it really matters. So let's go up here and we'll get rid of that. Get ourselves a diamond. All right. So this is good. Oh, good. So this must be like a diamond floor or something. Let's get ourselves a stack now. Oh, wonderful. Yeah, okay, we'll clear this floor out then. So I suspect we'll be chucking some other stuff out as well. That's all right, I can do that. Fantastic. So, oh, hello. Yeah, and there's more. Now that's the, that's Mithril, right? Which I don't necessarily really want more of, but okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna eat uh, some of this black grass. Like a whole pile of it. Clear out another layer. Okay, then we'll get rid of this. Okay, and oh, is that pink diamond actually? That is, isn't it? Pink diamond sells for hefty prices. Okay, that is what we want. Yes. Okay, this is fantastic. This is a good layer. <laughs> I'm definitely going to be checking out some more stuff. Okay, so let's get rid of uh, this pile. Yeah, this is good. Okay, excellent. So I imagine once you kind of get a layer or two like this, you basically just go, yep, time to leave. Because then you're content with the amount of uh, ridiculousness that you're going to have. All right. Yeah, no, that's good. I'm glad to finally get that. Okay. Beautiful. I can see us getting three or four stacks in here then. We're just going to have to mine all of it. <laughs> That's fine. We can do it. We got this. Okay. Oh, time to eat. Well, eating's good. Eating makes room, right? That's what we're looking to do. Yeah, let's eat. Okay, so we're nine on those. Right, so now what I want to do is uh, get rid of amethyst. Yes, that's what we want. More diamonds, please. Just put them in my diamond pouch. This is ridiculous. So at least we got, we got two hefty price ones. Uh, that's good. So that's going to pay for another maker machine. And then the rest of these will go towards the rest of our all of our upgrades that we've got to do and stuff. So I feel like we're, you know, finance-wise, we're sitting at a good place. Um, I think that kind of sets us up. I'm still, I'm curious, like, other than, I guess, romancing somebody and then upgrading our house and all that, it, it is interesting, like, where, where we're going after this. I was thinking about, like, what's the next season hold for us? Um, that's interesting. Uh, let's get rid of these. Uh, yes, okay, I got diamonds. <laughs> I was trying to make sure, like, what did I end up getting there? It's all getting fuzzy. Um, trying to figure out what, like, I, I'm guessing, like, this game isn't Stardew Valley. I won't be playing it for eight seasons, you know, or, it, like, it won't be going on forever. Um, but I'm kind of curious where the where you start kind of hitting the, the main uh, plot cap, like on the, uh, or the main arc of things is where it's sort of, I'm assuming after a season or two, it kind of, you've seen the main points. I mean, I feel like even after the first season, we'll have done a good chunk, it seems like, but I might be mistaken. Um, so I'm excited to see that, at least. Again, yeah, I don't know how far I will go or take the game. Well, I'm kind of at a point where, like, this game I'm, I'm enjoying playing and I'm enjoying seeing where it goes. So I want to see it at least to a certain point. 
I'm, what I'm going to try and do with a bunch of series, I was mentioning in another video, I'm, uh, I'm at a point where I'm going to start trying to like wrap up some of the series I'm doing. I've got way too many series going. It's not like sustainable. I know that. Uh, it, it's been fine on the year, this year of COVID, uh, to do as much as I've done because, you know, uh, it's easy to justify this hobby when you've got nothing else you need to be doing. <laughs> But I think as we come into a uh, back into uh, spring summer, I'm gonna want to get more active in doing other stuff. So I'm probably gonna try to wind down a little bit. Plus, I have some other projects I would really like to do. Um, I, I I do I've I have a long-standing interest in game design. Uh, actually, pre preceding this, I was interested in board game design um, because I like game mechanics. It's a thing I very much love. And I've so I've had ideas for doing some small, you know, some small projects uh, with video games, but not really followed through with anything. Uh, but I'm at a point where I'd, I would like to do something, and I just need to make the time for it. So I, right now, I've kind of like I've I've consumed all of my free time doing let's plays. So I'd like to free up a little bit more free time and keep going, keep going with like a reasonable number of series, but get it down to like a couple of videos a day and not where I've been at, which <laughs> there's a point where it was, it was, I, it was baffling to me. I was, I look and just go, that really, that's, I was that busy. Wow. A, a little much. So it'll be good to, uh, to slow it down a little bit, but I think still keeping a pretty good pace. As I was noting the other one, I, I realized we're kind of on track to have done uh, about 5,000 videos very soon and that to me oh, another pink diamond very nice that to me is an astounding number um i i always i basically when i started doing this whatever five years ago i i kind of in my back of my head i thought like how long would i give it before i you know i kind of just got like not tired of it or just kind of burned out or i just see like how far could i go and i thought well, if we get like, if I do like 500 videos or something, that'd be quite a bit. That would really be giving it a fair shot. <laughs> and we, we definitely long ago blew past that. And then I thought, okay, well, you know, a, a couple thousand videos or something. And it just, the, the number kept kind of, whoop, let's aim straight. The cumber, number kept jumping up further and further. And to the point where we're at now, which is like, okay, that's a lot of crud. Oh my gosh. Um, you know, getting to 5,000 is utterly ridiculous. I'm going to try a bit more mining or uh, hoeing here because I'm curious, to, like after getting that statue, it just made me think there's got to be more stuff in he these things. But I'm wondering if it's just random or like if it's at certain levels. I have no idea. Just do a little bit. Um, at any rate, yeah, getting to like 5,000 videos. And, you know, the channel's done all right. I, I'm, I'm not, I had no expectations for what the channel would do. I'm not, I'm, I think most people that watch the channel would know. I'm not a person that's interested in, in being super, you know, famous at doing this. Uh, that doesn't interest me at all. I would like to be successful enough at it that I can justify the amount of time I've put into it. That would be nice. So I'm, I'll probably focus more on, you know, some of like doing shorter series, I think that would be a thing. Um, not committing to huge uh, 100 plus episode series as much though th I love doing them but boy it's uh, it's quite the treadmill to get on and uh, it would be I think good for me and for the channel to just do some shorter stuff <laughs> it's, it's just ridiculous I think we're gonna go down now I think that's the sig the sign that we need to go down okay let's uh, pull out our udon pop a couple of these Okay, now let's get on down. Okay, 111. Oh, uh, let's hoe, I guess, and see if we can find the exit first. Okay, there's the exit. So now let's just smash some rocks. And I, I don't feel like this is going to be another diamond layer, but if it is a diamond layer at this point, we'll just take the diamonds and run. Uh, so far, I'm not getting the sense it is. So that was at layer 110. 
No, this doesn't seem like a very exciting lair. Okay, I'm going to go down. 112. Uh, um, but yeah, I've got you know a variety of things I'd like to be doing. There's there's things I've intended to do more of. I I did want to do uh, it, again just as a random thing, a bit more audio book type stuff because I enjoyed doing it and I it annoyed me that I didn't get back to doing more of it after I started doing a little bit. Um, those things drive me nuts when I I want to continue with projects but then just get way too busy. So I'd like to do a little bit more of that and then, you know, work on some game stuff, ideally. That would be nice. Again, no no huge ambitions there, but it would be fun. Alright. Um, there we are. But yeah, I've definitely realized what a uh, an interesting... To, to actually, like, do this uh, even as a kind of job. <laughs> as, like, the most part-time of things. Um, how not lucrative it really would be. Like, if, if somebody was looking to do this to get, you know, to make a bunch of money, to go do something else. <laughs> it's a terrible way to... You, even after doing this for five years, uh, I'm like, you, you know, you make a bit of money, but it's not uh, worth the amount of time you're going to sink into it. Or very unlikely will be. I guess that said, it's just a, a, some people view it as the lottery. I, I didn't go in with any ambitions. I come from podcasting, and I've been doing that for a few years, so I knew it's not that lucrative. <laughs> I was like, yeah, this is not a thing you do because you're going to get rich necessarily. You do it because you like doing it. Because if you don't like doing it, don't don't, don't waste the chance that you might do well at it. Because it's such a you know, it's a, a, a such a random chance. I think realistically so it's not a uh, not necessarily the most viable thing to do um, that that's why I doubt anybody that I've, like whenever you know somebody asks about like any advice which I've had over time a few people have asked for advice I don't know how, how much they really want advice or you know just whatever um, I just always say just and it's the, the advice I'd always read is just consistency just like do make some videos and then make some more, and then just keep doing that. And if you guys, you can handle that level of um, the mundaneness of it, because it's you know uh, the, the bureaucracy of running yourself like a project manager. It's beyond I think some people. If that's not your, your like you're not good with that, then you know you maybe this isn't a great idea. It's hard to be this organized. I think. If you're if you're super into just playing games and not super into like um, managing yourself, I guess. But also just the idea that expect that it's going to take quite, it could potentially take a long time. Like I feel like we've we've hit a very good amount of subscribers in the past uh, year or so here, but it took five years. I mean, we're perhaps anomalous. Uh, it's it's really weird. I think most people would have just quit, honestly, at, by this point. I don't know how many people, how many channels would per persist as long as we have um, with such a low subscriber count, which I, I thought, I don't know, yeah, that may, perhaps says something to our persistence, but it says something about the medium. I, I Again, there are small accounts, though, that do put out a lot of content. I'm certainly not alone. Um, but yeah, it's it's a weird thing. <laughs> It's not a thing I would definitely recommend most people get into. I, I think most people are past the illusion, though, of seeing it as a as a cash cow or something. Okay, let's. That's enough. There's not nothing good in this layer. Let's go down again. So we're at sixteen. You know, I'm not seeing much. It, that that is just like that layer. I just need to find like another diamond layer. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm getting to the oh yeah, an hour twenty, so my voice is gonna like go at this point. No, not really. I was I didn't even think on a shorter episodes I don't even think about bringing water, um, but this one I was I was like oh yeah I should have thought if I'm gonna do a uh, an ultra long episode, 
And to be fair, I did like three episodes before this, so I should have been thinking. I was excited to get uh, get going with this. I wanted to get mining and see what would uh, come of this. Okay, so that's there's our, our ladder down, so let's break some stuff. Yeah, so, you know, level 110 was good. Uh, I don't know. Oh, we're falling on our rear. Okay. Let's eat a pile of food. This is good. It's definitely the food is going to become the thing that just determines where we exit, I think. Okay, now what I'm going to do is um, just jettison that. And then we'll take all the, the good stuff here because we may as well... Um, same with this. I'll just eat this here, get this one, and then we'll go down. Okay, level 118. So we've made like a couple thousand, I think, in coins as well, which is interesting. I was curious how much you actually make uh, from all of that. All right, there you go. Um, yeah, there, there's uh, there's still lots of stuff I would like to do though. Um, I think the uh, if, if this were a, like a few years earlier, I would consider doing something like uh, more of a more of like a Patreon model and doing a, a side thing that is, you know, more um, like thinking of doing like readings and series that are more driven by the audience. But I don't know that that's such a great model anymore. I think that's kind of so overdone that uh, I don't know that there's any value in going there. So I'm not sure where the future of all these things lies. I mean, I, I guess everyone's in the same boat with that one. It's like, um, where do you take this? I don't know. <laughs> I definitely, I don't like the ad-driven model of anything. Um, I've been doing web stuff since the 90s and like creative projects of various kinds and have struggled with this question since then since they're really you know before there was like you know google as an ad uh, revenue stream um even and uh i i couldn't come up with anything other than like you know in canada we have like lots of grants <laughs> that's that's our system is like you get a grant from the government and that's like the best you could really hope for and there's not a lot of great models. Okay, level 120. So I'm wondering if every 10th level, maybe there's some diamonds. So I'm going to wallop around here. If not, we'll just keep going down, I guess. Till we hit like one. It'd be nice to hit one more good layer. I'm not seeing that this is it. No. I don't think that's it. All right. We'll hit stuff on the way back just to make sure. I'm surprised on some of these bigger layers. Like when you're thinking, okay, there's got to be some diamonds in here. But it's not a diamond layer. But again, we'll get like 30 grand, I think, on our good stuff. So, you know what, We're, we've done okay. I think, if that's the, the way that I'm adding things up right. <laughs> Okay, there's the way down. Let's smash a few things though. Getting fatigued. Okay, now let's eat a few more meals. So I'm gonna uh, also, yeah, let's get rid of, okay, those, those blue stones, I'll take a few more of those. And then I wanna get rid of, uh, See, I've got some stuff that's not so good. Okay, I'm filled with the blue stones now. Okay, so what I'll do is let's go over here and ditch oh, the jade. So everything else is, I'm at a, oh, that's, that's a decent amount. Okay, so we want, eh, and I didn't want that, but all right. 
Okay, and we'll try it. There we go. There's our exit. So let's now smash again. Okay, let's go down. That doesn't seem great. So we're at level 123. Okay, and I guess we'll try that. And now we'll start a smashing. Now, I haven't seen a, like a hole in the ground for some time. Do I don't remember. Like at near, When we neared the end, did we just stop seeing those? I don't recall. Okay, so this doesn't seem like a very exciting lair, so let's continue on down. Or let's uh, try to host raid. But yeah, it'll be interesting to see in the in the coming years here. Other than like even like a, a direct pay model like Twitch and things like that, models which, to be honest, I'm not that comfortable with. I I'm of an age where that just feels weird to me. <laughs> it does it. Something about it uh, doesn't feel. I don't know. I, I it's an odd model to me. I'm I'm much more comfortable with. Uh, the, the less impulsive, more those um, more sustainable subscription type things, or the things that where people are contributing in a way where they're getting their thing more meaningfully, and not just hey my look my name was on the screen I got a, a buzz off that. Not to be totally cynical, but there feels like it just feels somehow more exploitive of your fan base. I don't know that that's at all true. That could be entirely just me feeling that uh, again due to my age. That's a weird model. Um, so yeah, I don't know. I don't know what, uh, how other people are, uh, approaching things these days. I think a lot of the creative fields, I, again, it, these are questions that at least there's better tools out than there was, um, 20 years ago, but I don't know that there's necessarily better answers to these questions. Um, no one's figured it out yet completely. <laughs> what I feel like. Okay, if we find our way down, let's see what's in this layer. This, this is a big site. Could be interesting. So layer 125. Um... Okay, so what I should do is, oh, uh, we should definitely, okay, let's get rid of, good amount, good amount, good amount, okay, let's get rid of these. Okay, come back around and vacuum up any of those that I had. Okay, that was just a few, all right. Oh, come on, buddy. You got this. Okay, uh, let's eat. Let's eat the rest of these. Oh yeah, we're we're almost toast, aren't we? All right. Okay, this is. Oh, now we're getting some good stuff. All right, you know what? I'm probably just gonna take this and run, if we can load up on good stuff here. Okay, so I'm gonna get rid of this is decent, but I not decent enough. Um, decent, but not decent enough. What is this? Decent. Okay, I'll hold on to that for a second. Okay, I got a couple more spots for green and a bunch more for red. So I guess when we run out of that, I'll just get green. One more left. All right. So let's just watch for the next green one that pops up. There we are. Okay, so let's ditch this. All right. And if we can get ourselves another uh, pile of that, I think we're laughing.
All right, I think what I'm going to do... Uh, did I even find an exit? Where is the ladder? Where is the ladder? I don't think I did, did I? Oh, no, I did. Okay. I'm going to go down. We're close. I, I want to see... I'll just keep smashing now at uh, a few layers down here. Again, if I could find any diamonds, it would be worth my while, so... But I have a feeling like that's that. I think we're kind of done. So interesting that this is still becomes about as long as that other episode. I definitely I took more time as I got into this lower layer though. I wanted to be a bit more sure about what was available. So it does definitely seem like it, unless I can hit a if I if I hit a diamond layer, fantastic. If not, uh, you know it's like whatever. Okay. Uh, I definitely don't need that. So let's get rid of that. Okay, you know what? That's fine. Oh, hold up. Actually, I would take this blue one over it, wouldn't I? Uh, boy, it would be nice if you didn't have to do this 20 times. <laughs> I just want to keep magnetically like, getting all the other things. There we go. All right. And we'll try and find another... Find a stairway here. All right. Oh, there we go. So we're at level 127. So, you know, again, decent stuff, but uh, not nothing too spectacular. So we'll go down again. Um, how about there? Let's try here. All right. Yeah, I'm getting tired. What are we at? Oh boy, yeah, we are getting fatigued. All right, I think that yeah, this is going to basically be us, isn't it? Well, I'm excited to see what we're going to end up selling all this mess for, because this time we'll dump the whole lot. I don't see the point in keeping any of it, so... That's at least something. All right, well, why don't we just completely fatigue ourselves here? I, I, we won't have a problem with that, I don't think. So, I, yeah, go, getting to... Uh, you'd really have to be quite focused and not interested in mining at all to get down super deep. Which I could see. That could make sense to me. Um, okay, you know what? That's good enough, I think. We didn't fill up 100%, but... I don't feel like we're going to. All right, let's. We, we didn't even have our horsey with us. So let's head on back. We're going to go in here for just a minute. We'll load up a little bit. We'll recoup <laughs> before we die. Just so we're not exhausted tomorrow. So we'll get a little bit of our energy back. We'll go dump all of this stuff off. Except the statue. i got to figure out what to do with that. That's really cool. Oh, I see. I had one of the, the green stone. Blech. That stinks. Like, so we definitely could have walked out with a little bit more, but that's fine. I mean, we have like two, four, five, six stacks of diamonds almost. A couple pink diamonds. Oh, right, that is a good thing. Never mind. I said the same thing last time. It turns green in daylight. <laughs> that messes with you. You think, why did I pick up that garbage stone? I thought the exact same thing. I'm like, why did I have one garbage stone? My gosh, what a waste of my efforts. No, no, no. <laughs> Silly goose. So next time, or very soon, we should be able to also upgrade our axe and then uh, get on with that. So that'll be, uh, that's going to be good. Um, I think what I'm going to do is actually get out of here. And uh, let's go down. I don't have anything. Yeah, I have no room, so I can't even go and get wood. So whatever. And I'm going to go, I'm going to go straight to bed. I know it's 11 in the morning, but this episode went way too long. So let's, let's dump some stuff here. Like everything. 
Okay, I'm interested to see what this is. So we had two, two of these uh, pink diamonds, 52 diamonds, 48, whatever these are, sapphires, uh, 44 garnets, one alexandrite, and 32 emeralds. So a lot of sapphires. We went heavy on those. For a grand total of 44,000. <laughs> that is good. Uh, I'm not going to complain about that. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Okay, we're going to crash. Uh, actually, let's, let's see if we can put our statue somewhere. Can we put it on the table or something? I, I don't know what we do with this. Oh, place. There we go. Yes. Oh, nice. So we've we've got that figured out. Um, and then it was the, the next day is like a gift giving of chocolate. And, uh, oh, I see. You just need to have or chocolate cookies, it said. Do I have? No, I need butter. I've got the chocolate. I don't have butter. I'm going to have to go and get some next time. All right. We will see you then. Bye-bye.